Welcome to ITPK. In today's video, we will learn how to add device enrollment manager in Microsoft Intune. So that manager will be able to manage devices or that device enrollment manager will be able to onboard devices to Microsoft Intune and that device enrollment manager will be the administrator of the devices which are enrolled by device enrollment manager. The device enrollment manager account could be used to enroll devices to Microsoft Intune. Here the question is why we need the device enrollment manager account. The device enrollment manager is the non-administrator account which can enroll devices in Microsoft Intune. The device manager is useful when you need to enroll and prepare many devices for distribution. User that is signed in as DEM device enrollment manager can enroll 1000 devices to Microsoft in June, while the standard user can enroll only 15 devices to Microsoft in June. Please do not get confused used with an Tune admin account and a DEM device enrollment manager account because the device enrollment manager DEM cannot be an Intune administrator. A DEM account requires an Intune user or a device license. Remember you can create a new user and assign in tune license to be device enrollment manager or you can promote an existing user and assign an in tune license to be a device enrollment manager usually the it team or user use a local admin account to enroll a device into microsoft in tune by going to access work or school account here access yeah here so either it department and user login with local admin in the laptop or computer and then roll devices by login into local admin account and that local admin also gets promoted to the admin of device or that local admin get admin access to the device but here our device enrollment manager will have access admin access to the device as a local admin account so meaning that user will not be able to remove device from intune because device enrollment manager account will be the administrator of that device and device enrollment manager will connect that device to microsoft intune by entering the email of device enrollment manager here so let's go to intune to log in into intune you can use the url intune.microsoft.com okay so here what we will do is we will promote our current users to a device enrollment manager so let's go to user and search for test user i have created for device enrollment manager and here we go we have test user dem device enrollment manager let's first make sure this user have intune license assigned and enable let's go to licenses in the licenses section yes this user have e3 mobility plus security license assigned and let's make sure this user have microsoft intune plan one on so we are sure here this user have intune license assigned here so let's go to the overview and copy upn of this user because we will need it later on right the email address you can say of this user so i have copied this now let's go ahead and add device enrollment manager to enrollment section so go to devices then scroll down and go to enrollment section of intune once you are in enrollment scroll down and find we have to find here device enrollment manager here you go 
So please note that uh, this preview could be different for you, uh, right? Sometimes this is changed. So here we can add that UPN of device enrollment manager, the email we have copied earlier a minute ago. Let's paste here and hit it. right you can see successfully promoted user right this user is successfully promoted to device enrollment manager that's it this is how we can add device enrollment manager in microsoft intune this account can now enroll devices in microsoft intune the device enrollment manager comes with certain limitations so one important limitation is to wipe the device. So DM device enrollment manager could only enroll the devices but could not wipe those enrolled devices using company portal. Only the global administrator or in tune service administrator will be able to wipe the device. And also there is a limit of creating or promoting 150 DM account in Microsoft Intune. That is much, but in enterprise, that is normal. So now, let me show you if you want to enroll any device, right? Using Device Enrollment Manager, you can go to Access Work or School Account and then hit Connect. Once you go to Connect, then join this device to microsoft enter id here you could enter the account of test dm so here you can enroll the device with device enrollment manager once device is enrolled with device enrollment manager account then you can switch account and log in with the user account right so this device enrollment manager will be the admin of this account and this device and will be able to manage this device but user will not be able to disconnect this device because this device is enrolled by device enrollment manager here also in the computer management uh, users and computer management you will find out that device enrollment manager will be the part of administrator group here right once intune standard user will log in into microsoft intune device enrollment manager will be the part of this group right administrator group you can consider device and order manager as a local admin as well. That's it about today's video of device and roadmap manager. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe. Take care. Bye.